What's going on everybody? My name is Kai and welcome back to another video. We're playing the diner today. Uh kinda looking it's a looking a little cute, yeah, but apparently it's a horror visual novel. I found it in the horror section on the horror tags while I was just scrolling through games on itch.io and I saw it and I was like, you know, it seems interesting. Basically the premise is we just got paid, you know. Then we see a new diner across the street. And we're like, you know what? I should treat myself since I've been such an upstanding citizen. And now we're here. Just don't want a cheap shock now and walking with a bus down. Pull up and I'm flooded with a iced out watch. With it look like butter, baby. He can drop. He can drop. Put that phone in some drop. Stand my nuts. Count a lot. Saw a lot. I walk through the doors and sign my name on the guest list. Kai. Whenever I get paid, I always eat somewhere in order to treat myself for my hard work. Yep. I've always tended to dine in the same restaurant. However, I've decided to change things up a bit. I have heard of a new diner that opened a few months back, and I decided that, a new, that now would be a perfect time to check it out. It's small, but the decor inside is really nice. That must have been where I, they spent their budget. I picked up the, new, the menu and began to look at it. There aren't many choices, but that's not really a problem for me. I think I'd like to order... Oh, I can choose. Hmm... The Quandale Dingle Special is what I'm craving right now. Yes, I crave that sometimes as well. It's been a year, Daddy. I really, really miss you. I'll tell the waiter when they arrive. Hello there. A guy who must be the waiter walked towards me. It was almost funny how his black and white appearance contrasted the cutesy white uniform. He looked quite young and short, but he must have—he must be an adult if he's working here. My name's Akino. I'm gonna be your waiter today. What's your name? Uh, I'm Kai. Well then, what do you want to order? Quando Dingle Special. If you don't mind. Get the hell out! Get out! Of course, I'll get that to you. A few minutes later, the waiter returned. There's a problem in the kitchen, so I'm afraid your food's going to be delayed. It's pretty empty in here, so mind if I chat with you for a bit to pass the time? Oh, that's no problem. It seems quite busy to me. Maybe it gets even busier. They must pay a lot for advertising. So nobody's dining with you tonight? Uh, I prefer... No, I haven't been able to see my friends a lot recently. I probably have one that I can count. He smiled wide before resuming. Which is why I'm talking to you. Uh, I don't know if I consider you my friend just yet, buddy. Back up. Well, I'm flattered you consider me friend-worthy. How long have you been working here? I don't consider him friend-worthy. Since the place opened on my 19th birthday, I thought it would be a perfect small job to have, and I like the cutesy atmosphere. I can pause for what felt like a while. He felt conflicted about something. Hey, do you... I can know. What are you doing? Get back in here and serve orders. Yes, sorry, right away. Yeah, get back to work. You, uh, you just do that. He ran off in an instant. I waited a short while for my food to arrive. Hmm. One special Quandale Dingo special. Let's go. The Quandale Dingo special. Oh, thanks. Hmm, wait a minute. Something wrong with this Quando Dingo special. Fucking wait, boy. Boy ain't no wait, boy. Boy ain't no wait, boy. Wanna grab a coffee? What? Anyways, thanks for the food. I'll be sure to. What kind of question is this? I barely know him. That's so. That's weird. That's kind of weird. What? I talked to him for like maybe like five minutes, and now I don't really. But you know what? <clears throat> Just because I want to see what happens, I guess we'll grab a coffee. I'd love to, but I'm really busy with work. That's okay, your work is more important. Maybe next time. Ah, there we go, okay. I quickly finished my Quando Dingo special and left. I always love a good Quando Dingo special. Where to now? I felt a light tap on my shoulder. Oh, hey, Akino. Hey, are you ready to go? What? Go where? The coffee place. 
But he said no. Did he change his mind? I'll show you where to go. What? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what are you talking about? Hey. Hey, uh, I'm, I'm, hey. Duck or stay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to save. Do I duck or stay still? I'm standing still. I couldn't react in time and his fist collided with- What? He- What? <laughs> Thanks for making this easy for me. What? Are you good, my boy? Everything started to become clear now. Is this an attic? I tried to push myself off the ground. I can't move my hands. It feels strong and sharp. A zip tie? Man, you could easily- You could easy break out- the zip ties are not that strong. They're really not. You could easily break out of a zip tie. Hey, Akai. Are you okay? You look scared. What do you mean? You hit me with an uppercut. You hit me with a with a right hook. You didn't seem to have anybody who would wonder where you were. People usually go to diners accompanied by at least one person, but you were alone. You were an easy target. Anyways, I'm bored, and I'm sure you're bored too. Let's get started. Oh, I see. <clears throat> nice I do I enjoy that I guess I went out and bought a nice new shiny one just for you Wait. He ran the knife over my thigh Blood ran down my legs And the floor beneath me quickly became wet And uncomfortable to sit on Your blood is so red That is how blood works <clears throat> Uh, don't, don't scream There's no point it hurt so bad, it hurt like hell, but I didn't want to give him the satisfaction of hearing me scream. He raked the knife over my flesh again and again and again. I began to cry, I wonder what I had done to deserve this. Uh, I should stop before things get out of hand. I feel like things already got out of hand. What the hell did I do to deserve this? You want to answer? Yes. Nothing. <laughs> Obviously, he's just a psycho. He's just insane. And my eyes began to close, and now I'm dead. I woke up in the middle of the night. It's quiet downstairs. Is Akano asleep? My eyes landed on the wooden cabinet on the other side of the room. What could be in there? My growling stomach reminded me that I hadn't eaten since the diner. The Kwando Dingle special wasn't filling enough, I get it. Maybe there was food. Uh... I say, we inspect the cabinet. He only bound me with a zip tie. I could easily break out of this and not check out that cabinet. That's what I'm saying. You could have, he could have broken out of it when he was right in front of him and just like beat his ass, like easy. I pulled my wrist apart as strongly as I could. I heard a snap. I rubbed my sore wrists and slowly walked towards the cabinet. It doesn't seem locked. Scared that he come, that he come back, I quickly flung open the doors. He's got a bunch of knives, let's go. Many knives were lined up inside the cabinet. They all had different dates scribbled onto the blade. What? What do these dates mean? My thought process was cut short by the loud slamming of a hatch. What? No! You're in the attic, you idiot. I can hear your fat little footsteps from my room. You saw my knife collection, right? Would you like to add to it? Why didn't you grab a knife? Oh my god. <laughs> this thing is trash. I ended up walking into the cabinet. Wait, exactly! The cabinet is full of knives! Take that! I grabbed a knife and charged toward talking about Not today! I felt the hidden power rise from within me. I wasn't, I wasn't gonna die in an attic. And not by some five foot four little boy! With one quick movement, the knife swiped across his throat. Oh. I got his ass. You. What are you? You aren't. You... His body soon became limp and he fell to the floor. What are you talking about? What am I? I literally hit you with a knife. Why is he acting like I hit him? I like did some secret hidden jutsu technique. What are you doing here? What have you done? You think I'm gonna just let you- Ah! Uh, oh, my vital organs! Ah! My vital organs! Ah! I felt like I should have been more affected. 
by what just happened, but I felt incredibly numb. Like I'd seen this a million times before. What is this feeling? Time to get out of this fucking house. That's that feeling. Yeah. Good end. You defended yourself. Let's go. There are five endings to get. Can't you get them? Can you get them all? <clears throat> okay, so I do want to see what happens if I duck. Ultra instinct. Womp, 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 womp. He tried to punch me. I begin to run, but I'm caught by his other hand. What? He's super small. I felt the back of my head collide with the wall before I begin to lose consciousness. Really? Do you see how short and small he is? There is no way. I must be incredibly weak. Money so big, niggas think I'm yeet. Bitch, you can't compete. Lil Ho, get on your knees and lick the cheese. Yeah, so that's it. I think that's it. All the other endings, are, I'm pretty sure, are literally just me dying. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Because it's a cool little game. It's a cool little game. I feel like the endings could have had a bit more variety. But... Because, you know, they all end. They literally all end except for one with me dying. But still good either way. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya. Bye. Bitch tryna fuck with my heart, that's a whole new bot when I put on my headphones yeah. Like little speed while I run around my I don't fuck with these hoes, it be for everybody She gon' switch out demeanor when she see me like hella Yeah, yeah Like heights, Donnie Big Don, I'm a dollar I'm drinking tequila and bad What a lot, she done